Happy Wednesday to you. It is Wednesday morning, about 10 to 7-ish, I would think. I don't know. I left a little bit late this morning. So I was going to wear a long sleeve dress shirt, and then I was like, no, I don't want to wear a long sleeve and have to deal with it all day. So I wore a short sleeve dress shirt, and then told Stephanie goodbye, and then came to work. Um, listening to the radio this morning on Wednesdays. They do a little thing on the radio show that I listen to called Things That Must Go. And I think we should do that. Every Wednesday we're going to have a Things That Must Go where I'll tell you things that I think must go. And you guys leave down in the comments below Things That Must Go. Whether it's, uh, well their little catchy song says, You hate your co-workers, you stub your toe. Things that bug us, things that must go. One week, yeah, so anyway... Leave down in the comments things that must go. What's the thing that drives you nuts? Is there one of your coworkers that chews with their mouth open? Is there uh is there someone who you always see in traffic in the morning that weaves and it doesn't get them anywhere? What bugs you the most? Put it down below and I will think of something to tell you guys about in just a second. Good morning. So, little boy. Going on field work. Yes, instead of field trips, they call it field work at his school. And what are you going to do? It's called Kaleidoscope. He's going up to this really cool old building uh, in downtown Salt Lake where they have dances, like dance companies put on stuff, performances and stuff. And he gets to go during school today and go watch some performances so he can learn how to be a good audience member, which will be pretty cool. Um, I wish I could go, but I have school and I have to work with stuff. But he'll help tell me all about it, huh? Yep. And he'll tell you guys all about it, too. Yep. Um, yeah, my throat's still not feeling so hot, but other than that, I'm feeling a lot better than I was last week, the last couple days. Hello, amigos. Oh, I just had lunch. Actually, I haven't had lunch yet. I got Subway. It's Febru-any. How exciting is that? It's like any tober only. Febru-any. Pretty excited about Febru-any. Um, just went with, uh, with John, with Jer for lunch, and got Febru-any, but we also went to the hobby shop, so I got a part to replace that broken part on my truck, which is exciting, and because I got aluminum instead of plastic this time, so hopefully it won't break again in the future. And Jared got the part he's missing, so we're definitely gonna go wheeling on Saturday, which is exciting. Good times, work's been kind of wild this morning. Some stuff went down that I'm not allowed to talk about, but it's all good, nothing, nothing bad on my end. Anyway, driving back to work. Here's a phenomenon that I have not mentioned, I don't think so in the past on the vlog. Where I work is about by air, maybe five miles from the shore of the Great Salt Lake. The Great Salt Lake is a huge lake. If you're not from the United States and you're watching this, Google Great Salt Lake. If you are from the United States and you never thought the Great Salt Lake was that big, Google Great Salt Lake. It's big, it's salty. You can float in it. It stings your eyes or if you have open cuts, if you get in the water because there's so much salt. In the Great Salt Lake, there are big nasty carp and brine shrimp, and that's about it, seagulls. But uh, right before it rains, which smells like it's definitely going to rain, said it's supposed to be rain turning into snow later, right before it rains, the entire valley smells like not even good ocean water. It just stinks. When I grew up, where I grew up in Salt Lake, when I lived, in kind of the downtown area of Salt Lake. It was super strong, and here at work it's super strong. But uh, it is definitely a salty lake. Nasty smell out here right now. Um, What's going on tonight? I don't know, I'm gonna go home and fix my radio control truck with the parts I got with Jer. And uh, we're gonna wait to eat dinner until Steph gets off so we can all go out to dinner because it is payday and it's always nice to do that. I think we're gonna go hit up the magic walk. And uh, we'll have to see. This is video where the I can't sit far enough back in the seat to get the whole meal in. What's up, baby? How was work? What is that? What's up? Of course, cornbread muffin. We are at Famous Dave's. We have only been here like once or twice ever. We wanted somewhere different for dinner. Stephanie didn't want Magic Walk. This is so cheap. We're having good dinner. Hi guys. Um, I have not ended the vlog for a while, as you know. So I'm going to do it now. And um, we just got home from an amazing barbecue. 
awesome. What was your favorite part? Um, I gotta say there was um potato logs. Tasty. So keep watching, subscribe, and turn your friends doing all that stuff when they see it tomorrow. Peace, you.